If I could change one thing about John Calvin, it would be that he not have been a part of the Servetus affair. I mean, everybody who loves what they have learned from John Calvin wishes that they didn't have to apologize for the fact that even though he didn't want Servetus to be burned at the stake, but done something, I mean, executed in a more a humane way, he was in favor of executing Michael Servetus for his heretical views of the Trinity. That legacy of state and church intermingling has not served the Puritan history well. It took Baptists <laughs> and Roger Williams and America and a, a redone America to get that fixed. And so I feel bad that culturally and theologically that's where he was. And we have to figure out a way to fold that into the life of the man and see how God's grace can forgive and can make him useful in spite of that sin.